Welcome to an example on how to perform matrix scalar multiplication. Here we're given matrix A, which is a two by two matrix, and we're asked to compute negative three A, which means negative three times matrix A. So to find negative three A, we perform scalar multiplication, where the scalar is negative three. So again, negative three A means negative three times matrix A, So to perform this scalar multiplication, it feels just like distribution. The result of this scalar multiplication is going to be another two by two matrix, where each element in this matrix is going to be the product of negative three and the elements in matrix A. So the element in row one, column one is going to be negative three times negative three. The element in row one, column two is going to be negative three times one. The element in row two, column one, is going to be negative three times one. And the element in row two, column two, is going to be negative three times negative four. So looking at how we perform this scalar multiplication, notice how the scalar negative three appears here in each product. And the original elements in matrix A appear here in the products. And now simplifying, The first row we're going to have positive nine, negative three. The second row we're going to have negative three, positive twelve. I hope you found this helpful.